Hey guys, what's up? Tama Home here, welcoming you to a brand new Let's Play of Shenmue the First Game Remake on PlayStation 4. It has been a while since I've done a Let's Play. Don't worry, my Final Fantasy 9 Let's Play is still, you know, I'm still thinking about doing that. I just don't, I don't know, I'm kind of like gone on, off Let's Play in a bit because it's kind of like a hobby for me. But anyway, we're not talking about Final Fantasy now. It will come. This is about Shenmue 1. I've been wa waiting to play Shenmue 1 for many, many years. I had this game on Dreamcast, finished it, loved it. It's Shenmue. It's my favorite game of all time. I've done the Let's Play of Shenmue 2 for uh, Xbox 360 on my when I was recording on my crappy iPad. So I won't be doing Shenmue 2 Remake because I've already done Shenmue 2, the Let's Play, but I am so glad that Shenmue 1 has came out and we are going to go through this adventure together. Um, it's been, like I said, it's been a long time since I've played this game. A long time. And you've already, if you already know, like, giving you the background of the story, like, if you've seen Shenmue 2, I told you, this is a young guy called Ryo who's going to avenge his father's death. It just feels so weird playing it on PlayStation 4. I'm more concerned about the QTEs in this game. So yes, for like, oh my gosh, Shenmue 1. This is nostalgia for me, guys. This is nostalgia, and I'm so glad to be playing it again and sharing this experience with you guys. I'm alright, but... Hazuki Sensei, uh, my father. How the story began. Oh my gosh, God, I literally can't believe this. I'm actually playing Shemu One. Um, it's going to be like weird playing it on PlayStation, though. I mean, like, I've always played, I've always been playing this on Dreamcast. My Dreamcast broke many years ago when I was playing this game. So I would be playing this game and then my Dreamcast would just reset. And I remember it was in the middle of saving and then it just corrupted because it just reset. Now I don't have to worry Fusa. about that. Fusa! Real son! Fusa! as he enters the dojo. See the ultimate bad dude himself. Father! Stay back, Mio. For the last time, where is the mirror? I've no intention of telling you. I have a little battle. No, you just get to see in action just how good this Chinese dude is. Why you? Yeah, I did look like at it. My life. Now then, no matter how often you ask, I'll never tell. Do you remember 
Chao Sun Ming. Chao? That's the name of the man you killed in Moon Swoon. It can't be you. Get up. I'll allow you to die like a warrior. Tattoo of the organization he works for. Yep, so that's the thing. Four days later. Well, fa fancy that, your dad nearly died on your Christmas. A letter for Hazuki Sensei. Plans to have a nightmares about your killer as well, or your father's killer. This is where we start now. Right, we've got a couple of phone numbers in the notebook. We've got the old classic notebook. Oh, this is going to be weird. <laughs> right, and so we're going to start here. The mirror, dragon mirrors, design style. In Landy, murdered dad. War dragon roads, wear fighting style, tattoo on his arm. In Ming Soon, dad killed a man named Zhao Sun Ming. Uh, which, in Shenmue 2, if you've seen the Let's Play or know about it, they, they named it in reverse, so he was called Soon Ming Zhao. Uh, what happened that day in the Jojo? So we need to find out what's happening. So what's to move around? Because this is new to me, guys. So obviously we've got... Oh, we've got Rio's watch here, story collection, collectibles. Ah, oh, cool. It's like the Dreamcast. Dreamcast version saving. Oh, man. Oh, this is awesome. And those of them slots here. Moves, collections, obviously cassettes. Oh, my gosh, we've got cassettes and stuff. Right, to move around to the analog. I'm assuming that R2 will be um, 
is actually going to be the um, running when we get out of town. Your son, you should still be resting. Uh, I'm fine, really. And you? Are you all right? <sighs> yes, but I must keep busy. Otherwise, I'll get depressed. I understand. But you needn't work too hard. Mm, yes. Oh, by the way, I have this for you. This is for today. Well, hey, allowances. We get allowances every day. From tomorrow, I'll leave it on top of the shoe cabinet every day. Do you know where Fokusan is? Fokusan? I believe he's in the dojo. Really? Thanks. Righty ho. It's good start. Yep. So R two is to run. I'm guessing, if I remember correctly, yeah, this is the toilet. <laughs> yeah, I'm need to go for a poop. No, never mind. We just obviously like I know the Japanese have that sorts of toilets. It's like a shoe, don't it? Right. Before we actually leave the house, there's a couple of things we need, or we can actually search the house for. So. Mm. So if we go into the kitchen, it is good to investigate old utensils and knives and forks and shears, so we don't need them. Oh, same again. If we open the fridge, nothing. I'm pretty sure there was a cockroach somewhere. Okay, fair. And I'm pretty sure there was milk some Ah, oh, I think the cockroach is in there. Cockroach? It's just a cockroach. I don't know why I found that quite amusing. I really don't. You know, cockroaches, she's Right, uh where else have we got? Uh what's in this one? I do believe there's like like I said, there is some items which you can actually collect here, but it has been many years since I played Shemu one. I don't want to talk. I don't want to, I want to look down into that cupboard. Oh my days. Oh my fucking god. I swear I'm going to swing for this game already. Or maybe you just can't fucking know. No, I don't think you can. Okay, fine. Uh, okay, well, for now we're going to look at this food. Look at the food, Rio. Looking at the food triggers a flashback. Ryo, while you're still sleeping in bed, farmers are working hard in the fields, carefully picking carrots one by one. So how can you waste them like that? Okay, I'll eat them. To answer your question, Sensei, I don't like carrots. It's really simple when you don't like something. Good. <laughs> That's my boy. Okay, well, I just earned myself a trophy. A silver trophy. And guessing unlocking the memories actually unlocks trophies. Mwahaha. <laughs> I haven't even actually looked at the trophies yet. Hmm. And if we go in here, we read this letter. Dear Ryo, those who follow the path of a warrior must be ready to die in order to stand by their convictions. Live for one's convictions. Die for one's convictions. That is how I lived my life. Ryo, it is up to you to discover your path and follow it through. 
My father must have known that Landy was coming. He must have done if he wrote that letter. Right, we've read the letter. Don't care about the lamp. Huh, what's this key for? A key? But to what? I think I know what it's for. This may come in handy. Maybe. Right. We go in here now. I think there's just robes in here. And the move set. There we go. We we can learn the move twin blades. Probably means I don't have to buy it later. Right, this should be the living room, I think. Oh no, this is the altar room. Nothing interesting in there. Books! No one likes books. I can see some matches up there. We shall take those. So we've got ourselves a box of matches. Might come in handy later on. Can't remember. Can't remember. Mm -hmm. No, nothing important there. 